Good morning, I'm Manny Anton with The Morning Report. US markets started the trading day in positive territory with the S&P 500 briefly passing the 5500 level for the first time ever, before giving up early gains and settling lower by the close. In the S&P 500, it closed down 0.25% and the Nasdaq finished 0.79% lower. The Dow Jones bucked the broader trend by closing up 0.77%. Stocks look like they're headed for a winning week, with the S&P 500 and the Nasdaq notching new records. Turning to US sectors, the worst performer was technology, which finished down 1.6%. The best performing sector was energy, which finished the day up 1.86%. After opening higher, AI giant NVIDIA closed down 3.5% as the recent surge finally ran out of steam and investors took a breather. NVIDIA stock has now climbed more than 160% this year. In other company news, Darden restaurants closed up 1.5% after reporting better than expected earnings. Gilead Sciences surged 8.5% after confirming a successful late stage trial of its HIV prevention shot. On the macro front, fresh economic data added to the view that the economy is softening with higher than expected weakless jobless claims and poor housing starts and permits. A reading of the Philadelphia Fed Manufacturing Index also came in below expectations. In European news, the Bank of England held rates steady yet left the door open for a pivot to rate cuts in the months ahead. Norway's central bank also held steady. In contrast, the Swiss National Bank unexpectedly cut its key rate by 25 basis points, making it the Swiss Bank's second cut this year. The SPY futures are pointing to a 0.1% rise. Thank you for watching and have a great weekend.